Welcome back. The Northwood University International Auto Show is just getting started today, and this year they are featuring more than 500 cars for everyone to enjoy this weekend. I'm joined now with Leighton Bellefs for the University International Auto Show's executive board. Thanks for joining us, Leighton. So what is the auto show this year? What are we talking about? So the auto show features about 500 cars. We have anything from aftermarket looking into parts to hypercars like a a McLaren Senna, and um, it, it runs all throughout the weekend. We'll, we'll be gone today, tomorrow, and we'll feature our Cars and Coffee on Sunday, which is from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Amazing, and I'm understanding that it's entirely run by students who serve on the e-board. What's the planning that goes into putting on this show of this caliber? Yeah, so it's completely run by students. We've been going, we've been uh, planning for about the past 12 months, just making sure everything's supposed to run smooth. And it's uh, there's 20 of us on the executive board, and then below us we have all of our captains and team members just getting all the booths set up just to make sure it's show ready. And you said that there's a VIP panel at Northwood Stavos Graduate School of Management. What is that all about? The VIP panel is pretty much just industry professionals and um, important or important alumni that, um, that sh just showcase the show. Um, they talk about their, their careers in the automotive industry and their time at Northwood. That's amazing, just to learn from those who are actually doing it right now. And I understand this year there's going to be a Women in automa Automotive Roundtable. That's happening tomorrow. Who's on that roundtable? Um, I believe there will be a representative from Cox Automotive. I'm not too sure um, who else is going to be on it, but we're going to have some very important members of women in the, automotive, in the automotive industry tomorrow. You said that there's a wide range of cars that people can see in car parts. There's that cars and coffee event also scheduled for Sunday. What does that include? So uh, at the cars and coffee, there will be well over 100 cars there, people from all over the state and even the, even the nation. We're going to have coffee from Live Oak, which is a business in town, cookies from our hospitality team. Um, we're going to have three awards this year and dash plaques with ID cards. That's, that's a do not touch. <laughs> and how many years has this show been running? We've been going strong for the past 60 years. This is our 60th show this year. That's amazing. Anything else that you can tell us about this weekend long event? We have, we have some very, very cool cars that uh, I'm excited for more people to see. Um, we have a collection this year from down in Florida. It's a private collector who has a uh, Hennessy Venom F5, a McLaren Senna, and a Porsche 918 Spider, and they're completely free to see. Uh, we don't charge any admission, and we're excited for people to be there. Well, an admission is free for the Northward Universal International Auto Show. The show runs starting today through Sunday. Make sure you head out and take a look at this amazing collection. Like I said, admission is free for the Northwood University International Auto Show. It goes until Sunday. There are many opportunities for you and family to take part in it with signature events, photos, and interactive booths. The auto show is the largest outdoor and student-run car nor show in North America. It has over 500 vehicles from more than 65 manufacturers, vendors, and private owners. For guest ages 21 and up, alcohol is also served at the Tavern 59 from 1 to 3 at Northwood's Hens Stadium for Saturday's football game. Or you can head to the Four Seasons on the Mall Walk for live music and Woodside Grill from 3 to 6. As Leighton just mentioned, there will be plenty of food trucks for all to enjoy in the specialty lots.